This is the NFL Pickup here in Stormy, Texas. This is Week 5 Predictions deep in Stormy, Texas. Well, it's cloudy, by the way, but it has been stormy, and it would be very depressing, especially when I'm on the uh, antidepressants. Uh, but anyway... Yeah, there's two pros. Uh, there's a pro and a con for the medicine. The pro is it's working, but the con is the con is it make me feel like a zombie. Yeah, and they was asking questions like when I was uh, getting the assessment and stuff like that. They was asking like, "Do you feel tired all the time?" And I put yes. And do I have feel like I have low energy? Yes. Well. It doesn't. It doesn't defeat the purpose of the medicine trying to help me. If it's going to make me tired even more, because only in the morning breakfast starts at five thirty, and in between breakfast, then we have the the medicine, and then between medicine we have the uh, snack. Well, at least I take the medicine, but and then in between snacks, then we have lunch, and it was like there's no time for you know at least letting the medicine work out. And, you know, it's two hours in between. So, you know, I'll try to get to sleep in. And cause sometimes the medicine can come back and haunt you during the day. Yeah. And I don't take medicine again until, you know, later at dinner time. So, yeah. So, <clears throat> I might as well leave. I'll try to do it something early. I'll try to start the NFL pickup earlier. And, uh uh, my allergies is probably mixing with the other medicine. It's like, oh, whoop, whoa, what is this for innovators? But anyway, <laughs> oh boy, and I had a big brother joke because uh, not only Joshua was left, but there was a, a gentleman that was here way when I came in along with Joshua. Uh, he left uh, today, and. I was like, whoa, so now there's just two of us. So I came up with a Big Brother joke. I said, wait, are we the two finalists in Big Brother? <laughs> yeah, and then the staff laughed at the, at the joke, thank goodness. So <laughs> Sometimes it's all about delivery at times. It's all about delivery. But um, anyway, oh, by the way, um, Chief Justice had gave a uh, funny uh, Ishmo, Joe Ishmo comedian that was on Conan at one time, but uh, that was really funny the other day. Okay, so let's go with the NFL pickup. Let's go with the NFL pickup. You already know what happened about uh, uh, about Kevin McCarthy. He had no committee, no uh, no vote in the Senate, nothing. Just one vote in the House, and you're done. You're done, son. That was really. That was really. Oh my God. That was the Washington D.C. screw job. But then. Even though he knew it, uh, he knew that was going to happen, but still, wow. So all of our votes that have something to do with us, it could be slow. But with with the, they want to drop a leader, it happens so fast it could happen overnight. Unbelievable. This is why Washington D.C. is so dysfunctional. It's so dysfunctional. Anyway, let me get with the the NFL pickup. Anyway, uh, we're at week five and uh. Tomorrow game, aka Thursday game, starts with uh seven fifteen at uh Ashton and uh oh god no all right who okay 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 who gave the idea to get the commanders a prime time game who would who who wanna hire up a, 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 an the NFL thought it was a great idea to get the team with the worst name in the history of football a prime time matchup with the Bears. You know I'm going for the Bears on this one. There's no doubt about it. I'm not I'm not gonna be embarrassed myself on my own segment on the show and picking the commanders. There's no way. Even though the commanders have been lucky a couple of times this this uh season, but there's no way that I'm not embarrassing myself on my own program and picking the commanders. They're the stupidest team in the NFL. I know they run. Yes, they ran out of name, but this the commanders does not sound scary. The commanders does not sound scary. Okay, okay. Oh my god. And they gave them a prime time. 
Thursday night football with the Bears? I'm going with the Bears. Easy. Then we just had this. This is a Sunday at 8 o'clock, uh, 8 o'clock or 8 30 game. Yeah, 8 o'clock, uh, yeah, 8 o'clock or 8 30 game, something like that. Then we had the Jaguars and the Bills play already. All right, all right, all right. And this is week five, isn't it? Yeah. All right, all right. I'm going with double down. I'm going with the Bills to be the head and the Jaguar to be the tail. Okay. Okay, all these other games are 12. Most of these are rematches. We just had the the Patriots Saints game. We just had the Patriots Saints. Wait a minute. Are you sure this is week five? Yeah, this is week five. We just had the Patriots Saints game. Now we're having it again? Oh, my God. Well, you know who I'm picking, and you know who I'm not picking. I'm doing the ride or die thing. I'm picking the Saints. Yikes. Okay, now this is a true double down. The next few games is a true double down, and then another ride or die. Uh, we're going to start first with the Colts versus the Titan. Uh Titans had a pressing, uh, an impressing, um, uh, let's just say an amazing one. I was trying to use like uh, uh, sportscasters, but uh, <laughs> it's the medicine again. But anyway, uh, the Titans had an amazing win on another team, and uh, they're playing against the Colts. So they're putting them in the double down, and Titans going to be the head. The Colts is going to be the tails. Uh, favorite Steelers, I'm putting the Ravens in the head position, and I'm putting Steelers in the tail position. Yeah, that's good enough. Ho, 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 boy, Malachi, you are not going to be happy because I'm picking the Panthers to, to, to just go ahead. I hope they did their homework over the, uh, over the, uh, uh, the past few days because they, they know they're being, a, uh, they're trying to be a, uh, a crazy Lions team that, you know, uh, this is ridiculous. The Lions are winning? Really? No, they're not. They're not winning against the Panthers. No, they're not. I'm going to Panthers, ride or die all the way, all in. Okay. Uh, this is going to be a crazy week. I know it. It already happened. It already happened a crazy season. Now, we only been to four weeks. <laughs> we only been to four weeks of the season. It's already been crazy. Anyway, I still can't believe that 70, uh, 70 to 20 of the uh, Broncos, uh, Broncos Dolphins game. I still can't believe. I'm never going to believe it. Unbelievable. Anyway, uh, Texas Falcons. Uh, of course. It's part of the home team of Big D Country, Houston Texans. I got to go with them at the tails. I mean, I got the, the tails. Tails? No. I got to go with them at the head and the falcon, falcon at the tails. Oh, my God. Now you believe me with proof that medicine is making me tired? Anyway. Okay. So, oh, yeah. The Giants didn't have such a good game uh, last week. Uh... However, the Dolphins had a phenomenal game this uh this past week. So, I'll tell you what. I'm going to pick the Dolphins to be the head, and I'm going to take the Giants to be the tail. There you go. For the double down pick. All right. Uh oh wow. Are we already on a are we already on a two oh five game already? We did all the twelve oh five twelve o'clock games already. Wow, that was fast. That was fast. We're already at the... Uh... Yeah, we're, all, we're already at the 305 game. Wow. Okay, so the next is going to be the Bengals versus the Cardinals. Bengals going to be the head. Cardinals is going to be the tails. And another rematch. And this one is the... 305 game. Another rematch. We already had this game already. I've already thanked the Eagles to, for being the Rams on it. Now i got to thank them again? We just had the games already. 
So now I got to thank the Eagles again. Come on, now I got to beg the Eagles to beat the Rams on a ride or die game again. Holy crap. Wow. Most of, a lot of these games are rematch, except, except for this one, which is the Jets versus the Broncos. And my land, after the shellacking that they had over the past couple of weeks, you would think that they might be ready for the Jets. Now, they don't have Aaron Rodgers, but uh, I know they had another uh, quarterback uh, playing. But, uh, wow, wow, I still, I'm still in awe over that. But it's a 3.25 p.m. game. Uh, I'm going to pick the Jets definitely to be the head, definitely, most definitely, and the Broncos to be the tail. I mean, what could I say? All right. Oh, wow, wow. So these next few games are putting uh, two of my team in head-to-head order. Uh, they're both going to be a double now because of the way the swing could happen in part of the game. Now, this one is the last 325. It's uh, the Chiefs. And somebody is team Taylor Swift, which I still bump up out, out, out about that. Uh, versus the Vikings. So I'm going to put the Chiefs at the head and the Vikings at the tail. All right. Uh, that was Cowboys, right? That was Cowboys and the 49ers. So in the uh, Midwest, Midwest versus the West. All right. And this is the seven fifth, uh, This is the seven thirty game. The prime time thing. Uh, I'm going to go with, of course, I got to put the home team at the head, which is the Cowboys and the 49ers at the tail. Oh, one more team that is playing, and this time it's at a Monday night game with a 7-15 uh, kickoff. Uh, Green Bay Packers will be facing uh, my other team, the Raiders. Oh, my God. They say, uh, a couple of a couple of the teams faces the uh, off each other the last part of the the, the game except for the Houston Texans, but anyway, <laughs> wow, I didn't see that coming. I didn't see that coming at all. But I'm going to go with the Raiders as the head, and I'm going to go with the Packers as the tail. So there you go. Uh, that is week number five. I may come back and go ahead and do week six so I can get this done and over with early just in case things go crazy and wacky, especially with my medicine and, and everything. So, but other than, other than that, uh, this is week six, and don't forget to please uh, help me with my, um, as I try to raise money to get a hotel, so someone help me on my feed as I uh, await my appeal or even at least the waiver of uh, disability and all that stuff. So, yeah. So, well, there you go. We five. Put it in our box.